Hi, I'm Lissy. I am in New York to do some promo. I just finished up a, a month-long tour a couple days ago, and so now I'm uh, kind of traveling around doing things like this, interviews and um, singing for offices of people. Really, any anything anyone needs me to do, I'm, I'm here. So. <laughs> I moved back to the Midwest. I've always wanted to have a farm in Iowa at some point in my life. And so last year I just was like, now's as good a time as any. Like, I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna start solo touring. Um, not gonna make an album. Bought this farm in Iowa. Well, I actually haven't lived in my farm yet. I've been touring. So I basically, I, I'd said I was gonna take a break and not make an album. Really between March and June, I, ended up making an album that I said I wasn't going to make like um, like very like in a very relaxed fashion and then you know with the album coming out actually then started band touring again with like different musicians yeah so I have this land now and I've been fixing up a house um, and there's an old dairy barn on the property that's like not in any shape to be a studio yet um, but you know my long term plan is to turn the dairy barn into you know not only like a studio, but like a guest space slash like, you know, cozy den like, you know, have almost this little like creative oasis so that, cause I am on the road all the time um, and I am in cities. So to be able to have that contrast of having like a peaceful place where I can be creative on my own, you know, I have a pond on my property, like go, let's go swim in, let's have a cookout, let's make a song, you know, have it feel like a leisurely creative space. I had written some of the songs that are on my Wild West, like at the beginning of 2015. There's a few songs on it that are like older than that. Um, you know, I had said like, oh, I'm not gonna make an album. I'm just gonna finish up a couple songs that I'd started. And so I went to LA to Kurt Schneider after I decided like I'm moving and preparing to like leave California and go back to the Midwest. Uh, I'm just gonna finish up a few songs. And with that kind of being my only goal, I didn't even have like a release in mind. I just wanted to not like let these songs get lost. I wanted to finish them. Um, then I started writing new songs and, and coming into the studio like, oh, okay, well, now we finished these songs. I actually have like one more song I wanna do. Uh, and musicians would come in and we'd just track it live. You know, My Wild West took on this kind of almost concept album. Uh, you know, revealed to me in the process, it, it wasn't really conscious at the time, but that I was reflecting on the 12 years I spent on the West Coast, you know, and in California. And, um, you know, even calling it my Wild West was kind of a way for me to process and reflect on and, and move on from the 12 years that I did spend in California, which were probably going to, you know, we'll someday I'll look back and say those are some of the best years of my life for sure I had so much fun I just wanted to be able to get into a studio and see what happened but that's expensive so I wasn't really allowed to like get in a studio and see what happened until like a handful of people signed off on my songs. You know, I didn't have the songs yet. And actually this new album, My Wild West, uh, Don't You Give Up On Me, which is the single that's actually done better in the States than I've ever done before on radio, was a song that many people told me was just not a very good song. I mean, I was basically given the impression that the chorus just wasn't any good and that it needed to be a better song. And I cared, and then I stopped caring, and then I did, and then I made it anyway. And now, you, here, there you have it. It's doing, it's doing all right. Hi, I'm Lissy and you're watching Babel Music.